Hey everybody, Mike Phillip Hall, live in my living room. How are we doing out there today? It's Wednesday, and it is the middle or hump of the week. Hump day. <laughs> uh, let's see here. What do we got going on today? All right. When I woke up this morning, I thought it was going to rain. Looked out the window, and the sky was dark. And even the leaves on the trees were like, it's going to rain. It didn't rain. And now the sun is out and it's a nice afternoon. And so for that, we have to roll with it. We can't change the weather, right? We can change We can complain about it all day long. But the weather is the one thing in this world that you can't change. It, is, it just doesn't change. Um, I mean, not at our command. <laughs> it will change, especially here in upstate New York. It changes all the time. Okay. Um... Going on to our subject here today, my subject today is uh, you never know what's going to happen in life, and I'll tell you what I mean by that. Uh, I was on my phone this morning checking my email, checking messages, just doing things, you know, that are, are a normal day, and I got a notification from Etsy, and uh, someone had sent me a message, and they said, they were interested in a painting. Now, the painting that I'm talking about is this little guy right here. I actually just uploaded this painting literally last night before I went to bed. This is the painting. It's a little, it's a little Christmas painting, okay? I literally uploaded it before I went to bed last night. So it was online at like 1 o'clock in the morning. And I filled in the description. I had put the whole thing up, and I thought, well, um, even when I refreshed it, it hadn't shown up yet. So... I thought, well, it, it'll be posted in the morning. I'll check it out then. So this person was interested, and they asked me if I would take a picture of it against the easel. So I did, and they because they wanted to see the dimensions of it a little bit clearer. And so I did, and a few minutes later, they sent me, uh, I got a notification from Etsy saying that the painting had been sold. And the cool part, first off, the cool part is the painting was sold. I don't, you know, to me, anything you make and someone wants to buy it, that's cool. It, it's such a, it's this incredible feeling. Someone wants something that you made. The cool thing beyond that is the person that bought the painting is in London, England. So that's a long ways from here. That's not around the corner, next town over. You know, you can't drive from here to there. You know, it's, it's a long ways away. And it's international, so it's like, ooh, now I'm an international artist. Isn't that cool? <laughs> it really doesn't matter. <laughs> Just the idea that, you know, it's like, oh, you know, it's inter you know, it's like it's got to leave America to go to its new home, which is in London, England, which is really cool. I really like that. It's neat. So, yeah, so that's kind of cool. Um, and I'm very excited about it. Uh, Someone, I've been making my, my uh, YouTube videos for a little while now. Um, I've got a bunch of them uploaded. There's numbers. There's all these different metrics that you follow. You get people here, people there. Listen, at the end of the day, it's like this. If you watch my videos, I appreciate it. If you watch three seconds of it, I appreciate it. Um, it life is all about numbers to begin with anyway. So if you want to watch them, great. If you watch three seconds of it, 10 seconds of it, or the whole thing, thank you. I appreciate it. Um, that, that said, um, you know, I, I keep making them. Uh, I'm not going to stop making them now. I, I've, I'm trying to, de to develop my, my name, my art, create this brand that's, you know, Mike Filippello, Maple Sky Dream Tree Studio. That's me too. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Uh, the person, I have a new subscriber and that person sent me a question and they said, how did you get involved in painting? Um, it's kind of a short answer. Many years ago, somebody gave me a gift card uh, to a craft store. I went into the craft store and I thought, I always wanted to try it. So I bought the paints, I bought the brushes, I bought the canvas and the rest, they say, is history. 
Um, I fell head over heels in love with painting. I still have that head over heels feeling today. I do aromat. I do all sorts of paintings on paper, on wood. I even paint on um, clothespins. Um, so I do, you know, it, it doesn't matter. The, the surface could be huge or it could be a teeny little surface. If there's space available for me, me to put something on it, I'm going to put something on it because everything needs a little color in life, right? <laughs> so that's how I got involved in it. Uh, that's that's really it. Um, Artomat's been a, a big venue for me, the little blocks. And I've been doing that for 12 years. And in that time, I've done over 600 of the little blocks. So that's, and that's each one. That's not, they're not mass produced in any way, shape or form. Each painting is unique to its, to its own, to itself. So that's it. Um, I'm trying to keep my videos to short and to the point. Um, I'm always watching the time. If you see me looking up like this, it's because I'm looking at the timer. Um, you know, you try to keep it, you know, I don't want to bore everybody, but I also want to, you know, I want you to watch. I'm exciting to watch, man. <laughs> Anyways, uh, I uh, want to say thank you for watching today. I appreciate it. Hope you're having a great day. And uh, I will see you again very soon. I have another video coming up very soon uh, on Monday. And we'll make it a nice video and do something good for you. All right. We'll make you smile. Probably not like this. We'll go. Anyways, uh, thanks again for watching. You have a great day, and we'll talk to you soon. And remember, let's be nice to each other out there, okay? world's a crazy place, so let's, uh, let's try to find some common ground, and let's talk things out, and, and let's solve problems, not make them, okay? I appreciate it. Thanks for watching. Peace, everybody. Seriously, peace.